hours shortly after the president spoke, we got word of another shocker. An NBA player tested positive for COVID-19 and the league suspended the season. Mike, this is huge. It really is, and it means that the NBA won't be playing basketball for the foreseeable future. How long that means is, frankly, anyone's guess. But this latest development started tonight in Oklahoma City. Moments before the tip, the Oklahoma City Thunder team doctor ran out on the floor and talked with officials. The teams all left the floor, and after a delay, they announced the game had been postponed. In the hour that followed, it was reported the Utah Jazz center Rudy Gobert had tested positive for COVID-19. And shortly thereafter, the league announced that the NBA season was suspended until further notice. Meanwhile, Chris, it came down just about 45 minutes ago that the NHL is not suspending play, at least as of right now. They say they're continuing to consult with medical experts and they're in a wait-and-see mode right now. And when it comes to the NBA, does this mean we're packing up, we'll see you guys in October? Right, no. This, this is a suspension, not a cancellation. So the amount of time that the season is suspended is certainly up in the air. We don't know if it's going to be two weeks. We don't know if it's going to be longer than that. But the plan, anyway, as of right now, is to resume play at some point. It's up to the NBA when that happens, though. All right, thanks, Mike. You see? The Most High Yahweh Bashemio Shai, who this world calls God, shut down the NBA. Brock for Yahweh. Brock for Yahweh Shai. Brock for Yahweh. Brock for Yahweh Shai. Brock for Yahweh. Brock for Yahweh Shai. All praise to Yahweh Bashemio Shai Bashemio Kakadash. Yahweh is the true name of the Heavenly Father. Who the world calls God. And Yahweh Shah is the true name of his only begotten Son, who the world ignorantly calls Jesus Christ. I like to give double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone that rule well for preaching the 100% truth, in season and out of season, according to the Mosai's will, the correct doctrine, right? Giving up their bodies as a living sacrifice for the Mosai's sake which is their reasonable service. Double honors goes out to you. I would like to say peace, which is Shalom, to the elect of the nation of Israel. All right, the nation of Israel consists of you so-called blacks, Hispanics, Native Americans, all right? So Shalom to the elect of the nation of Israel, starting off with the 144,000 prophets, the house of David, right? As well as the one third, the great multitude who will receive salvation around the globe, all right? So the nation of Israel is you blacks, Hispanics, Native Americans, as well as you Israelite foreigners who may not look like a typical black, Hispanic, or Native American, but through the seed, all right, of your forefathers, you go back to Israelite man, right? And your spirit bears witness, your spirit's proof, it's evidence that you are an Israelite because you can accept this 100% word, the 100% doctrine. You're drawn to it, right? And you fit the curses of Deuteronomy, the 28th chapter, okay? All right, to give more praises to Yahweh Bashem Yahushai, Bahashim Kakadash, for allowing me to do another video through the Holy Spirit. And this is breaking news, all right? The NBA, NBA it's just, it says, NBA suspends season over coronavirus, coronavirus concerns, all right? And this is the doing of who the world calls God, all right? Because who the world calls God, his real name's Yahweh, all right? Is the king of terrors, all right? He's the almighty demon-like power, all right? He's not all love, okay? He's not just one emotion, all right? The reason why the coronavirus keeps on spreading all right, and more cancellations of all these so called fun events of America's happening because the Most High, all right, hates America and he's gonna destroy it off the face of the earth through what vast amount of plagues. All right, major plagues are coming to America and other parts of the globe. All right, famine, all right, lack of food, all right, cannibalism, people eating each other, all right, animals breaking out of zoos. Weird creatures you've never seen in your life, all right? Demons, okay? Diseases, all right? Worse than the coronavirus, all right? Race rights, okay? Martial law, World War Three, 
all right? Foreign troops on U.S. soil. All of this is coming to America. And ultimately, America's going to be destroyed with nuclear fire, all right? ICBM missiles, nuclear missiles, all right? By Iran, China, all right? Russia, they're going to shoot missiles at America as well as the allies, all right? America's so-called allies, all right? Of the EU and the NATO, all right? EU and NATO, they're going to shoot their missiles at America as well, okay? Because America's Babylon the Great, according to the scriptures, all right? And the Most High, Yahweh hates America because America shed is the wicked kingdom, all right? The elites of this world, they rule in darkness, okay? The earth is given to the hands of the wicked, Job 9 and 24. Who the world calls the devil, all right, is not a red man with horns, all right, in hell, okay? It's the so-called white man, all right, the elites, all right, they're the great deceivers, all right, deceiving the whole world, all right, thinking that you know, being um, transgender is good, being a homosexual is all right, okay, pushing the laws that they push, all right, is against the Bible, so the Most High hates, all right, these laws, all right? He hates America, all right? And America enslaved his people. His people are the Blacks, Hispanics, Native Americans, all right? The chosen race of God, okay? And his people were, um, of course, right? If you know history, you know that this land was built off of slavery, okay? The rape, robbery, and murder of the Blacks, all right? And Hispanics, Native Americans. Because the Hispanics, Native Americans were in slavery as well, all right? On slave ships, okay, as well too, all right? So the Mosai is shutting down America, all right? The Mosai shut down the NBA. What you simple blacks, all right, and Hispanics, okay, and Native Americans love, all right? But specifically, you blacks, all right? You what you will call Negroes, West Indians, Haitians, all right, but specifically you Negroes, you love this NBA, all right. Okay, but the most is gonna wake up and judge two thirds, all right, of the house of Israel, okay, because two thirds are gonna receive their judgment real soon. For why, all right, because they're wicked. Their lifestyle doesn't revolve around praising the Most High and following, um. Um, the law, statute, commandments, all right? Black, two-thirds of the nation of Israel, of you black, Hispanic, Native Americans, all right? The Most High is going to judge you with his wrath, all right? With death, okay? That's what's coming, all right? So, all praise to the Most High. Yahweh Bashem Yahushai, Bashem HaKadosh. We're shutting down the NBA, all right? Suspension, whatever you want to call it, all right? Lord willing, the NBA stays shut down, all right? But this is huge, okay? Because this, this is a big distraction, all right? For, um, this is a big way to wake up a lot of Israelites, all right? A lot of so-called Black Spains, Native Americans, all right? Because they love being distracted by the NBA, all right? But now the most I suspended it. Okay, so my first precept from the Bible, all right, because, all right, the Bible is not a fairy tale book, it's true, okay, the 100% doctrine is with the camp of Great Millstone, all right, Great Millstone, okay, and the spirit, all right, of Yahweh, Bashem Yahushai, the spirit of the Lord, the Holy Spirit has revealed that unto us, okay, because our doctrine never fails. All right. And it's all about faith. All right. And we believe. All right. It's Isaiah chapter 24 and verse 10. The city of confusion is broken down. What's that city of confusion? America. All right. Because America everything is a, a city of confusion. All right. It's all confused. All right. All right. These are um, these um these high government officials change their laws. All right, whenever they feel like it, okay. Um, you can change your sex, all right. You can do bestiality um, via 
um, uh, homosexual, um, bisexual. America is wicked beyond belief. All right. And the most high hates this place. All right. He's going to judge it soon. All right. The sins of America has reached the heavens. Okay. So the most high is going to judge this place by fire. Okay. He's going to send what you people call U UFOs. All right. But are really the chariots of Israel. Vehicles ridden by angels. All right. So the most, most eyes will send chariots to Israel, all right, to shoot what this world will call laser beams at America, all right? Things that you will hear in a movie, all right? But no, this is not a fantasy. This will become real life, all right? Terrors and plagues are coming to America, all right? And all praise, all right? Because the salvation for the elect, the remnant, all right, the followers of the Lord is coming, all right? Since the city of confusion is broken down, every house is shut up, that no man may come in. There is a crying for wine in the streets. All joy is darkened. The mirth of the land is gone. All right, and mirth meaning joy. All right, the happiness. All right, the excitement of the land. It says of the land is gone. The city is left desolation, and the gate is smitten with destruction. Okay, so America's finished. All right. It's going down the drain, all right? It's Isaiah chapter 13, verse 6. And there's nothing, all right, you people can do about it, all right? You Edomites, you so-called Caucasians, all right? You heathens, all right, outside of the nation of Israel. There's nothing you can do about it. It's Isaiah chapter 13, verse 6. Howl ye, for the day of the Lord is at hand. It shall come as destruction from the Almighty. Therefore shall all hands be faint, and every man's heart shall melt. And they shall be afraid, pangs and sorrows shall take hold of them. And they shall be in pain as a woman that travaileth. They shall be amazed one another, their faces shall be as flames. Okay? So the day of the Lord is darkness and not light. Okay. Who the world called Jesus Christ is coming back furious with anger, right? Seeking revenge, all right? On his enemies, right? Which are you heathen nations, okay? Outside the nation of Israel, okay? As well as two thirds of the nation of Israel, okay? So, the, so terrorists come to America in vast amounts of ways. It says, Behold, the day of the Lord cometh cruel, both with wrath and fierce anger, to lay the land desolate. And he shall destroy the sinners thereout of it. For the stars of heaven and the constellations thereof shall not get their light. The sun shall be darkened in his going forth, and the moon shall not cause her light to shine. And this is the point. And I will punish the world for their evil, and the wicked for their iniquity. And I will cause the arrogance of the proud to cease, and I will lay low the haughtiness of the terrible. So the Most High is going to punish the world for their evil, okay? I will make a man more precious than fine gold. What man, all right? A elect man, all right? A chosen man, okay? Who's doing the will of the Most High to the best of their ability, right? Rehearsing the righteous acts, okay? And only Israelites, all right? Only an Israelite man, okay? This is even a man than the golden wedge of Ophir, all right? So we're in some we're in good times, all right, as a spiritual man would see, okay? Because the day of the Lord, all right, the destruction of the wicked soon, all right. This is Matthew three and two. It says, And saying, Repent ye, for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. Okay. So what should you uh 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 um new listeners hearing, all right, what should you do? All right, since you just Found out that the NBA shut down, all right? That the coronavirus is breaking news, pandemic, all right? All these things are happening around the globe, all right? You should seek God, all right? Seek the Creator in the days of thy youth, okay? And repent, all right? Come back to the Most High, all right? The Most High is not a soft, so called white man, all right? With yellow, blonde, string, stringy hair, all right? The Most High is what you will call a so called black man. Right, if you were to see him, all right, 
The most size, the power of the Israelites, the blacks, Hispanics, Native Americans. The only living power, eternal. He never was created and he's never going to have an end. All right. So come back to your power. Repent and follow the law, statutes and commandments of the Bible. All right. Because this is your life. All right. This is life and death. Okay. This is salvation. All right. Salvation is coming to the elect. All right. All right. And punishments. So many glorious rewards is coming for the elect. The kingdom of heaven. All right. Slavery for these heathen nations. Because you heathen nations are going to slavery. All right. That's another reward. All right. Israelite men on top of heathen nations. All right. Power. Okay. Control. Okay. Having servants. All right. Forever. Okay. So glorious things are coming. All right. So repent ye for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. All right. Change your ways. All right. Submit to the most high. Pray fast. Okay. Come out the, on the highways and byways. All right. And listen to the word. All right. From the prophets of Great Millstone. All right. And present your body as a living sacrifice. Show the most high. All right. That you're about this. Okay. Listen to the word. Okay. Take notes. All right. Because this is the comforter. This is what's going to keep you secure. These scriptures. All right. Well, ultimately, faith from the Most High. And the Most High is protecting you or not. Okay? So, you have to build up your faith now. All right? Your belief and confidence. All right? And cut off the wicked. All right? The wicked vanities of this world. All right? The wicked lust and pleasures that lead to death and darkness. All right? Cut them off. And become clean. Be transformed for the Most High. Yahweh Bashem Yashai. All right? But of course, all right, that process, okay, of being transformed is going to lead with Satan, the spiritual demon Satan, who the Most High controls, all right, to test you, all right, to come on, to come at you in a wide amount of ways, all right, because it's a test, all right. But of course, the Most High is giving you a test, so there's a way out, all right. He's not going to give you something you can't bear. All right, you have to believe that. All right. Romans 13, 11. And that knowing the time that now is a high time to awake out of sleep. For now is our salvation nearer than when we believe. So the salvation for the righteous is near. Okay. The, the night is far spent. The day is at hand. Let us therefore cast off the works of darkness. And let us put on the armor of light. Let us walk honestly as in the day, not in rioting and drunkenness, not in chambering and wantonness, not in strife and envy. But put ye on the Lord Yahweh Shai Mashiach, and make not provision for the flesh to fulfill the lust thereof. All right. So it's a high time to wake out of sleep. The NBA is suspended. Lord willing, the Most High keeps this NBA suspended forever, all right? Because, man, this is a, that's a huge distraction, okay? All these mirth of the city. America's being shut down, all right? The spirit of America's ending, all right? All the fun and games, the party and bullshit spirit. The Most High's taking that spirit out, okay? And chaos is coming. All right, so the elect, we need to be ready, all right, spiritually, right, and have that, Lord willing, that we're a part of that number, okay, Lord willing, I'm a part of that number, okay, because of course, we don't know who is part of the elect, so we have to strive, all right, we need to rehearse the righteous acts, all right, try to make our calling and election sure, right, giving diligence, okay, giving effort to make our calling election sure, all right, so the Most High can have mercy on us, because that's, at the end of the day, the whole point, if God's going to have mercy on you, or is he not, okay, if you're a part of the chosen, which he chose, all right, or or if you're not, okay, so all praise to Yahweh Bashem Yahushai, Bashem Kakadash, all right, Lord willing, this video is edifying, 
to the elect, the sheep, all right, the sincere listeners, all right, death and utter peril and destruction to America, and shalom to the elect of the nation of Israel, Yasharala, shalom.